Tonight, life-saving reminders about the safety at railroad crossings. This after three people were killed in two separate crashes involving trains off Highway 1180 in Lauderdale County all in the last month. Twin States reporter Emily Erickson brings us those important reminders about just how dangerous the railroad crossings can be. In the latest accident involving a train off Highway 1180, one person has been killed after going around the crossing arms and parking on the tracks. Uh, it takes a locomotive anywhere from a half mile to over a mile to stop, depending upon the load and the speed of the vehicle. So those trains, they don't have an opportunity to stop to avoid a crash. It's up to the motor vehicle operator who's attempting to cross that railroad crossing. In last month's accident, a truck was coming through a private drive, but Solly says drivers should always do one thing before crossing any tracks. This is two different locations where we've had these crashes, two different types of train. One was a passenger train, the other one was a freight train. Uh, we strongly encourage everybody. In fact, there's a national push for the media to get out the word that uh, when you approach a railroad crossing, stop and look both ways twice. And according to Sally, this isn't the only issue facing drivers today. You know, we're, we're always talking about distracted driving. Uh, if you're at a railroad crossing or approaching a railroad crossing, do not uh, continue that text message or that phone conversation with an individual. Uh, your safety is most important to both the railroad as well as to us. Reporting in Lauderdale County, Emily Erickson, Twin States News. That latest collision involving the freight train yesterday is still under investigation.